Hey everybody, just wanted to welcome you to my channel, Trader Rob. Of course, I'm Rob. Nice to meet everyone. Um, what are the reasons for me creating this channel? Um, I have pretty much spent the last three years looking for... I mean, honestly, I don't even know what I was looking for. I definitely knew I wanted to get into trading. Um, I got into trading actually for my brother-in-law. Uh, he trades stocks and equities in the morning. And I don't know why I took the jump straight into futures. He always said, why don't you start with stocks? Uh, it wasn't, you know, the whole 25,000 uh, minimum trade. Uh, balance in your account so you're not like a, a you know labeled a, a day trader it's under that it wasn't it had nothing to do with that um, I honestly I don't know uh, I think it was probably YouTube there was something in YouTube uh, some video that I was watching and uh, it got me and it got me hooked and since that time man have I spent a shitload of time looking at every single video that you can possibly look at on the subject of futures, strategy, candlestick formations, psychology of trading. I mean, I have gone through it all. And the funny thing is that I have done every mistake that is known, that's been told to me on YouTube. I still make every single mistake. So I'm going to give you a little bit more of my story, but here we go to the intro. Alright, now that the intro has been played, um, I just want to make sure everyone knows that I am not giving any type of financial advice on this channel. Uh, this is strictly for inter entertainment purposes. I'm here to learn. I'm here to, to show you what I have learned in these three hard-ass years that I've gone through on futures trading. Um, and hopefully I can grow a channel that is here to help other traders and um, maybe take away some of the learning curve. I mean, I feel like I feel like every video talks about taking away the learning curve of trading, but maybe it is that you just have to go through it no matter what. Um, you kind of have to get through it, but if you do stick to it, you f finally something does start to click, which is another thing I heard a lot of people um, talk about and didn't know what the heck they were talking about and I just it, you know it, it was hard you know in the beginning I was just pumping money into my first trade station account um, then I switched over to ninja trader which is what I'm which what I'm showing you guys on my screen now um, I do still have trade station I um, I have a trading view charting account uh, that I have connected to trade station and um, I do keep that open, but I really do prefer Ninja Trader. I think for for what I need it to do, uh, it's it's a great product. Um, so you know, in the beginning, you know, they always say, you know, get on the sim, practice, and you know, try not to um, try. Don't go into live trading right away. Get into sim, see if you could be profitable in sim first. And what did I do? Well, first day of trading, I was in the sim account, lost money. I, I lost money in the sim. I didn't make any money. But guess what? Day two, I'm like, all right, now I'm ready for this. I'm ready for the live thing. I'm ready to put some money into the market and see if I can make some money. And boy, did I learn the hard way that... It is extremely difficult. Like futures trading, any type of trading, is very, very difficult. So I'm gonna get that right out of the way. But there is something at the end of the rainbow um, because eventually 
I'm, I don't want to say this is for everybody, but I know this is for me. Something clicks, man. And when that thing clicks, you kind of start to see the market different. Your trading style starts to evolve. And you really start to see some positive changes in your trading. So, man, I have uh, I have followed a lot of traders. There's some awesome traders on, on YouTube. Um, and everybody's got their own style. I, I probably am going to develop my own style of trading. I, I just want to share with you guys the some of the pitfalls that I've gone through um, and some of the things that are really starting to work now. Basic stuff, and I think it's, I think, shit, the more basic you get, I think the better you get in this game. Um, so, you know, I have started from candlestick pattern trading to, um, I went from candlestick trading to support and resistance I have traded um, supply and demand. So I have traded smart money concepts. I have traded morning breakout range trades. I have tried different types of algo algos and auto traders. I've tried Robert Anderson's um, five-minute gold line, one-minute gold line trades. Um, you know, I watch Patrick Wheeling in the mornings. I've seen him trade. I've seen, you know, his style, you know, the aggressive style. I mean, it, shit, it works for him. Um, trades, my, trades by Matt. Um, watched him. Uh, so, I mean, I've, I've sl I feel like I've seen a, a boatload of strategies I have tried a lot of them I'm gonna actually get through a lot of these videos I'm gonna go over some of the strategies that I've gone through and I'm gonna be honest with you something I really f figured out majority of strategies work hear this again majority of strategies actually work the problem is you have one bad day you have two bad days you have a morning where you have a bad trade and it's got to be the strategy. It's got to be the strategy. The strategy's wrong. Got to look for something else on YouTube. Shit, that's probably why you're on this channel right now looking at this. <laughs> um, so I, I get it. Uh, the one thing I will definitely say is, you know, majority of the strategies out there, um, you know, if you back test them and you don't over trade and you don't put too much. Uh, you're not risking too much where you start getting nervous. The second you're nervous in a trade, man, you're over trading. Not if you're over trading, but you're trading with too much size. I've learned that the hard way. Um, I have put a good amount of money into this. I call it a business. Um, you know, I'm in real estate, so I'm a real estate broker. Uh, pretty damn successful one here in the Chicagoland area. Uh, but I really, I just have a passion for, I don't know why, I love looking at these charts. I love figuring out shit with these charts. And I don't know what it is that draws me to it, but I love it. And um, not want to say that I, I'm not really a, a gambler. I don't have a gambler's mentality. Um, you know, I do go to the casino sometimes, and I like to play my blackjack or play roulette. So I guess there is a little bit of chance um, in my, you know, somewhere in my back of my mind that I like that. But I really wanted to think that this is, like I can make this into, uh, I guess in the beginning, kind of a side hustle. And, you know, I'm only 45 years old right now. So, uh, you know, I know retirement's still a little ways out there, but this would be awesome. I mean, if you could make a couple hundred bucks a day in your retirement trading stocks for maybe an hour, hour and a half in the morning, that sounds like a pretty good deal for me. So, um, you know, that's that's where I come from. Um, I think that's where I've been. I, you know, I, I, I'm super excited with a lot of the recent stuff that I've been kind of 
trading and getting pretty successful. Um, you know, I don't want to. Shit, I'm not even gonna jinx it because, but it's been it's been it's been going really well. Um, these last, I want to call it maybe six months, things have really. I feel like the market has slowed down for me. Uh, not slowed down as far as you know how many points the the S and P is moving today. More like the the chart and everything is slowing down. I. I understand I'm seeing moves differently and I'm being patient with my trades and I'm looking for bias in the morning. Just these three charts that I got here, I got a five minute, a 15 and a 60 minute. And you know, I, I've got them in this, you know, a color coded system where if it breaks or a, low, a lower high of the day, um, you know, it goes green or red. So. You know, at the five minute, the short term, it's red. Um, Midterm, it's green. Longer term is green. So, you know, generally I'm, in this scenario, you're looking for, you know, granted it's nine o'clock at night central time. So take it for what it's worth, what you see on the chart right now. But you understand what I'm saying. It, you know, you're, you're looking for some kind of bias to the upside. Um, before I would just trade kind of willy nilly. Um, but there are some trades that are very systematic um, that I have developed that I will share with everyone on this channel. Um, there is some, some basic stuff. There's a, there's a fantastic trades uh, that I have back tested the shit out of on oil. And it's, it's two trades per day. It's one at uh, eight o'clock central time um, that lack goes until nine o'clock, and then I got another window from nine to ten, and it's very simple strategy that has just been killing it. I mean, literally killing it. So I'm gonna share that in one of the videos. Um, for those of you that that follow the um, uh, trading journey of Robert Anderson, um, the guy is freaking awesome. I mean, he's super down to earth kind of guy. Um, just wants to help people and um, well he's been working on he's been working on this auto trader um, uh, kind of like an indicator that follows his strategy for those of you that don't know his strategy uh, he's he's looking at things on a one and five minute time frame on a one minute candle chart and he uh, you know he's he's got a few EMA lines that he's looking to kind of get pierced and kind of getting a pullback and then kind of an explosion one way or the other. It works. Uh, it works pretty well. I've been trading that strategy for maybe about eight or nine months. Um, I did, you know, he just released the indicator yesterday, um, or the, I should say the, the trading body, I think he's calling it. And I'll throw it here up on my screen. So um, I have it, I paid for it, and um, I, you know, I, I loaded it up today. There was a few issues with um, installation. I don't know, shit, I might even do a, a video on the installation of it because maybe just to help him out because it is easier than, you know, than what I guess was kind of coming out. and. The, the guy is great. I mean, I, I really truly admire the guy's channel. Um, and, you know, if I can help other people looking at this um, or helping them install this, if they do end up getting it, um, it's great. So I'm going to trade this. So today I traded this on the sim. Um, I didn't, uh, I ain't going to put real money into it right now just because there's um, there's some some uh, some take profit and stop loss stuff that I don't necessarily know is configured yet right on here, um, but what I'm gonna do tomorrow, I uh, shit don't quote me on this, but I'm gonna try to do this tomorrow, is I am gonna try to trade oil, the Russell, and the Nasdaq. And I'm going to try to either record it or stream it without much commentary. 
and maybe from like my opening from the opening bell at like 8 30 in the morning central time to about 12 and let's just see how this thing do goes um i know a lot of people are really interested in it you know we see a lot of the back testing that um that anderson has done and of course you know there's always people on youtube that are you know like, you know, you got to go for a year. You got to back test for a year. You got to do this for testing. And I get it. Um, but I just, I, I kind of, I want to try this myself. I'm going to go in the sim for a few days. And shit, I might even make a mistake. I might even go live tomorrow with this thing with my cash account. Um, it, just because I think I'm a better trader now than I was two and a half years ago. But I get excited looking. Look at all these. Got these colors over here on this chart, man. I mean, this thing is pretty, it's pretty neat. Um, I did watch this thing today for a good hour or two. And I got to tell you, it follows his strategy. Granted, kind of, he's a creator, so it should. But sometimes when you're coding things and you're developing product or software, it, you don't necessarily always get that end product that's pretty damn close to what you are visioning out there for trades and i think he and i think they nailed it um it really does what um uh, what he's preaching what he's teaching you know it, it it takes off trades when things are not aligning the right way um you know it's got an auto trailer in there so you know granted yeah this thing says three losses today um i have this set on the micro um oil so tomorrow i'm just going to probably just do a regular contract um a regular cl contract you know this thing here says four trades today for minus three dollars so i mean i think there was a few um there was three losses and one win but this is these are tiny these are dollar up dollar a point so you know and i'm not taking this by don't you know don't even look at that those numbers here yet today because i i'll be honest with you I loaded the strategies that he sent over and, you know, I don't even know if this stuff is right 100%. But I'm going to trade this tomorrow. Um, well, I should, I'm going to rewind that comment. I'm going to trade what I know works tomorrow. Um, so I'm going to be trading my strategies tomorrow. And at the same time, I think I'm going to leave a few of these screens up with... Um, you know, I, he used to start off really popular with the ES and the um, NQ, and then well, he's always been a, he's always he's always loved oil trades, um, but I, it looks like he's pushing now not pushing but he's focusing in more on more profitable trades, which he's finding in oil and the RTY. So I'll definitely put those up on the screen tomorrow and the Nasdaq because I do trade the Nasdaq on majority of my strategies. Um, and yeah it should be it should be fun just so you guys know i you know i trade on, on uh, uh through top step on their tra um, um trading plat uh, trading <laughs> out of the prop firm um but for the last three years especially from when i started uh, i've always traded a cash account i've always traded my own my own money um, you know, I'm not, there's not a ton of money that I, that I, that I put into this, but it's getting to the point where it's, um, it's, it's a good, it's a, I'm happy with the numbers that I'm at daily right now. And I really love trading the cash account, especially even over the prop firm accounts. I just think it's easier. Um, not that it's easier, shouldn't say that, but I feel like. The money's just mine right there for the taking, and I do enjoy that aspect of it. So I do trade with both. Um, you know, unless I 100% tell you that I am on a sim account, like tomorrow with the with this auto trader, auto bot that's going to be trading for this strategy. Uh, you know, I most likely, most likely, I will not be on a live account. I am going to be on a sim account, just trading that. But everything else, unless I tell you otherwise, is going to be cash, which is probably about 80% of the trade setups that I take. I do take some top step um, daily. 
Um, but I'll let you guys know. Um, there's no bullshit here. I'm not here to... Shit, I've lost money. I've made some money recently, but I've lost some, some money over the years. So I ain't here preaching about, you know, um, that, you know, I've, I'm not... I'm just... I'm an honest person that's hopefully put some info out there that might help some people. So um, stick around. Hopefully, I, I, I hope that you guys enjoy the content that I'm going to put out. Um, you know, leave leave some comments down below. Uh, I guess you're probably not going to have a lot of comments today because fuck, what the hell did I really, you know, teach you guys? I didn't really teach you anything. Um, or show you much, but I think I give you guys a good intro of who I am, um, what the channel's going to be about, you know, and I love, I love for the comments to be supportive, um, I got no place for haters, um, it's just, I really don't give a shit if you, if you got a different opinion, you can say whatever you want, but it's not going to bother me one way or the other, but let's just try to keep it positive, um, let's help each other, and let's try to grow, from, um, with each other, so, Hopefully see you guys tomorrow. Don't know if it's going to be a stream. Don't know if it's going to be recorded. I kind of figured this part out, but um, I'm excited. All right. Take care, guys.